Oh, guys, fun and games this morning. What a Tuesday. It's, I think I haven't laughed this much this oh, year. I'm so it's, glad It's you. great. Laughed and cried at the same thing. It's, it's ridiculous. I don't think I have anything left in me, but... Um, oh, we all, we all do yeah, it. Yeah, 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 you still got to do your... Goodbye, bro. Oh, I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know how I'm going to do this. But listen, um, let's, let's continue. It is a Tuesday, which means Travel Tuesday. And yeah. we've been alluding to the fact that, Katlejo, uh, you've been in Dubai, dude. And it looked incredible from what we've seen, those little clips that you've sent as well. And he was lucky enough to take a camera crew with him on his adventures. Yeah. So every Tuesday going forward, we'll showcase a little bit of what he's been getting up to in Dubai, which is a phenomenal city, I think, to explore how, and experience. It's like the traveler's dream. How do you start an odyssey like this? Where, what's the beginning? That's the thing. You've just got to prepare yourself for the unexpected and I've, I've got to say a big thank you to our friends at Visit Dubai for ensuring that we had all the ducks in a row and everything prepared for us in a five day uh, shoot where we had to you know push out seven segments. It was a lot yeah, of shooting but a lot of fun and a great experience to have and uh, it's a pleasure for us to, to share some of that with you and hopefully inspire the inner traveler in you. Well, Arriving in Dubai after a nine hour flight from Cape Town was a special moment because getting to the hotel, the Pullman Dubai Creek City Center Hotel, we got this very special VIP welcome, if you will. A lady who presented me with flowers and a scarf and a gentleman wearing his traditional garb poured me a little cup of Arabic coffee, which is the traditional way of welcoming guests into your house. So I really felt like the city opened up its arms and was ready for me to take on new adventures, learn so much about the culture, the people, the rich history of this region of the world. I couldn't have thought of a better way of being welcomed. Dubai, home to the largest building on earth, the largest shopping mall and a police force that cruise around in supercars. It's also a global tourism hub and the economic powerhouse of the Middle East. But through its opulent exterior shines a culture that is steeped in rich history. And I'm here to explore that history and to see the other side of this city of gold. As you can imagine, I was very, very excited to be staying at the Pullman Dubai Creek City Center Hotel, which was very exciting. And um, landing here first day and looking out at the view from my room, I was already just anticipating great things because from my room, you could already see parts of the city skyline, which is world famous, well known to everyone. That's just magic. Well, now that I'm settled in, I'm feeling rather peckish. And fortunately for me, the Pullman Dubai Creek City Center Hotel serves a high tea that is fit for a sheikh. And the wonderful way of enjoying it is in a room filled with art like this, the artist playground. It really felt like the stuff of royals, you know, like sheikh kind of stuff. Uh, the little trinkets they had there for me to nibble on, the macarons, the opera cake with fresh blended tea that I, I could have there. Blended for about three minutes, that's the ideal if you are a novice drinker, you're not used to the strong stuff yet. Ah oh, man, it was a marriage made in heaven. That was, as I said, a high tea fit for kings. So, I found my way around the hotel easily enough, good to go. But I've got to admit, nine hours on a plane from Cape Town to Dubai, that takes a toll on your body. And I'm in need of some pampering. Not only do you have the convenience of the great service that you receive at the hotel itself, but they've got their own in-house spa as well. Uh, Miss Pauline, who was my masseuse, very kind, a lady from Kenya. She was delightful and her hot stone massage was absolutely rejuvenating, revitalizing, re-energizing, which is beautiful because when those stones initially touch your back, there's a bit of a burning sensation that makes you want to go, ah! and then it starts becoming rather pleasurable and you enjoy the rest of the treatment. And it was really, really good. The facilities are just great because there you have the gym as well. The hotel is also connected to a mall. You just walk around the corner and you're right in a mall that closes at one o'clock in the morning. So you can shop literally until you drop. Oh, I've got to say, I'm feeling so relaxed and rejuvenated after that spa treatment. And people are saying my Dubai glows on fleek. Who am I to argue? But right now, I've worked up quite an appetite and it's time to see what's on the menu. The Medley restaurant is also another highlight of this wonderful hotel. The staff there, super friendly and always ready to help you with anything that you need. But the buffet is insane. 
I've got to admit, with so much to choose from, it's proving rather difficult to decide what to have for dinner. But what I am particularly excited about is that on Thursdays, the Medley restaurant has a seafood buffet featuring some of the most beautiful, freshest fish I've ever seen. And all you've got to do is pick your favorite and tell the chef how you'd prefer it done, and it'll be delivered to your table. Simple as that. Renal, I hear the Sultan Ibrahim is very good. And what's really special about it, the chef prepares it for you in the way that you want. And then you can have little side salads. The dessert buffet is also wonderful with an array of chocolate tarts, fruit bowls, anything that you could ever imagine having to eat for dinner. Five star service worthy of the Dubai experience. It's a whole package when you come to Dubai and stay at a place like this that all the way through from just my arriving here at the hotel, from the porter to the welcoming committee to the gentleman who helped me check in, the hostess at the Medley restaurant are an amazing team that really make it feel like when you enter the Pullman Dubai Creek City Centre Hotel, you are in the best hands possible to provide you with the most exquisite experience. So now that I've really settled into the swing of things, I'm looking forward to an amazing week and adventures like none other in this, one of the most inspiring cities in the world. Dubai, where the word impossible doesn't exist.